Hello everyone, welcome back to MathMod. Really interesting algebra problem today. We need to simplify this expression. We have a long product. We have 60 times 61, 62, 63 and plus 1 in the end. And we need of course to find square root from this from this value. How can we do this? We can first method we can multiply it but it's not a good method for us. We need to find a really good trick. How can we do this? I suggest you a really good trick at first. So take a look. If let 60 equal to for example n if 60 equal to n what will help we change 60 by n and right here 61 it will be n plus 1 right here n plus 2 as you can see and right here n plus n plus 3 so we change this this number by by n so we will have square root and inside this square root sign we will have n times n plus 1 times n plus 2 times n plus 3 and plus 1 in the end so what are we going to do next? Take a look. Let's group these n and n plus 3. So n and n plus 3 and this n plus 1 and n plus 2. So let's group these, these elements. If you multiply n by n plus 3, we will have square root. The first parenthesis multiplying, we will have n square plus 3n. So we multiply this, these two elements. And if you multiply this one, we will have n square plus 2n plus n and plus plus 2. So as a result, as you can see, n square plus 3n is the same and plus and plus 2. And in the end, plus 1. So as you can see, we just change these values by, by n. And right now, if you look closely to this, to this expression, we can see that n square plus 3n and n square plus 3n, it is the same. So we can easily use a substitution right here. If we put, so let n square plus 3n will be equal, for example, equal to t. So if it's equal to t, so what we will have? We will have t, this is t, this is t plus 2, so times t plus 2 and plus 1. If we simplify this, we will have t square plus 2t and plus 1. And if we look closely to this, this is our formula. a square plus b square. It is a square plus 2ab and plus b square. b equal to 1. So as a result, t plus 1 square. But this is expression without our square root sign. We work without square root, but right here we have it. So we need to put square root. And this is simplified expression right here. We will have square root of t plus 1 square. So let's do this. Let's plug in all of these, all of these elements. So as a result, this square and this this will disappear. T equal to n square plus 3n. So we will have n square plus 3n and plus 1 in the end. So plus 1. So let's plug in 60 right here. That put 60, 60 square, 60 square plus 180 and plus 1. If we add all of this, we'll have 3. 3600, 181, so as a result, what we will have? 360, right here 180, and 1 in the end, so our final answer will be 3781. This is our, this is our answer. So if you still have any question, write a question in comment, write a suggestion in comment about this method. Thank you so much for watching and see you in the next videos.